Guys, we're doing grilled sausage and peppers in my Ninja Foodie Grill. Come this is Cooking with CJ, the show about cooking, drinking, barbecue, and all the other stuff that goes along with it. I am not a chef, I am not a bartender, I am not a pit master, but I play all three on TV. I'm going to show you how to make quick, easy, tasty recipes and have a little bit of fun along the way. So let's get this party started. Hey everybody, welcome to Cooking with CJ. I'm CJ, and if you're a returning subscriber, part of CJ's crew, you know I love you. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that red subscribe button and the bell next to it so you get alerts on all what we're doing here. What we're doing here today is some grilled sausage and peppers on my Ninja Foodie Grill. So we just got some Italian sausage and some red, green, and orange bell peppers, and that's it. A little canola oil, a little salt and pepper, you're good to go. So the first thing you can see me do here is chop up these peppers. Just a nice julienne. I mean, not too tight, not too, not too big, not too small, but enough that it's not gonna just disintegrate away as it cooks. So you wanna leave it, you know, about a half inch thick. Uh, I sprayed it down with a little canola oil because like I said before, you gotta use a high heat tolerance oil in there. And then I put a little salt and pepper in it. It's cracked black pepper. And kosher salt all right and then i sprayed down the sausage with a little canola oil too so easy as can be i preheated on the medium grill setting it takes about 10 minutes on the preheat we'll get you over here we're gonna start cooking these bad boys about five minutes on one side five minutes on the other mix up the peppers as we go all right real simple real easy come on back all right guys we've preheated the ninja foodie grill we're using medium grill temperature because we don't need to like get these burned through these are going to take a couple minutes i've already sprayed them down with the canola oil i'm going to move them around kind of make sure the oil is covering all parts i'm leaving them in the casing okay so we're just going to lay them out you can hear a little a little of that sizzle i'm going to put them on the outside so it gets maximum grill all right Pretty good. All right, and then we're gonna throw our vegetables. We're gonna throw our peppers just right in the middle. And I want a few of them touching the, the sausages too, just cause we want all that flavor to kind of meld together. Boy, that, that is just a pretty sight right there. All right, so we're gonna let this cook for about five minutes. We're gonna mix the vegetables around a bit, flip the sausages. And then we'll cook it for another five. All right, guys, we're five minutes in. Let's move these veggies around. And then we're gonna flip, flip these around. Looking good, looking good. Got some nice grill marks on these. You guys should smell what is going on in here. All right, guys, another five minutes and we'll see where we're at. Just pump this up to grill temperature high. Uh, it's not cooking as fast as I had hoped it would. We're not getting the grill marks that I really want. So we're gonna do another five minutes of grilling on high. And I'll make the adjustments on the notes below. Hit show more and I'll have the, the grill times and the grill temperatures down below. Did an extra five minutes at higher heat. Let's temp them out. We want to make sure they're at least 165. Oh yeah, we're way past it. No big deal. All right, so they're good. All right, so we're gonna take these out, plate them up, and then we'll have a little taste test. All right, guys, we're back. I'm gonna try this bad boy. Just, there's, there's, to me, there's not too much better than some grilled sausage and peppers, a little marinara sauce. Ah, it's just good to go. Simple, easy, healthy. Ish, not the ish, but I'm gonna try this for you because that's the type of person I am. I want to try things for you and let you know how good they are. Bam! Oh man! Let me finish this bite. <laughs> mm, mm. I'm, I'm, excuse me while I take another bite. Sweet peppers, spicy sausage. Oh. You wish you could be here eating this right now. Although, if you're watching this, you probably wanted to make something like this. 
So you probably have the ingredients to make this. So you could be enjoying this with me. Who knows? Too good, boys and girls. Mm. <laughs> uh, and what can go wrong? Sausage, peppers, and marinara. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Mm. All right, guys, that's it for this week. Do me a favor. If you haven't already subscribed, hit that red subscribe button, the bell next to it. We have a lot of Ninja Foodie Grill recipes on our way. Uh, I'm in really enjoying this thing. I, I just can't tell you how much I am. It's it's really been, you know, I've been given a lot of gadgets to cook on, and you know, they all they all have a purpose. They all do do what they say they're gonna do. But this right here, this is something I actually believe in. I feel it. I think it's uh. I think this is changing the world right here. Not really, but it's it's a good it's a good good item. Uh, if you guys are looking to get yourself a Ninja Foodie Grill, hit the link below in the description. Take you to my Amazon store. Again, it doesn't cost you any more to go through there, but the channel gets a small piece of it. So anything we do to help that channel grow. All right. If you guys have anything else you want to see me cook in this Foodie Grill, hit the comments down below. Let me know what you think and what you would like me to cook in there. All right. That's it. Have a great week, everybody. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for cooking with CJ. Take care.